Ta-da, Malstar here, and welcome to Transparent Black. A regular afternoon class. A regular classroom in the sunset it bask. A regular story of red, yellow, and blue. Of which merely one color can conclude. I believe this is Liza. A clean desk. So I heard this game is actually pretty picky on where you, um, look at stuff. Your assignments aren't finished yet. You have to hurry or you'll be late for your part-time job. There are reference books in this desk. I heard that you're supposed to be looking like at all sides of the desk and maybe twice. Otherwise, you might miss something. So I'm- oh, see, this is what I mean. You grope around for a moment. And feel something fat and furry. You gulp back to scream. A quick look inside confirms your fears. There's a dead rat in a pool of blood between the textbooks. You can hear the sounds of giggling all around you. Oh, so you weren't kidnapped. It's later than usual. Do you get any overtime pay? So you didn't earn yourself any. In the case you didn't lie about it. What the? A snake carcass? For real? It definitely wasn't a toy, huh? We'd better bring the subject to the table then. Talk it through. So it's just bullying. The same as that time when you had your clothes torn, huh? And you just stand there crying? And that costs us some serious money. Consider this. Why do they pick on you and not someone else? Yeah, like you just picked the worst time in my career. You've been recently returning home later and later, and without bringing in any extra income. You were planning to run away, aren't you? Seriously, you dare revolt against your father? It seems you don't realize who is consuming the most. Dad, please. Stop beating my sister. I haven't done anything. You still have books to read, right? This has nothing to do with you. Go back to your room now. Then you... What? Am I reliving the past or something? The book cabinet. There are supplementary books and stationaries on it. You rummaged through it for a while. You found correction tape. What? The file cabinet. Locked. There's a number three on this. The date is written on a blackboard. And yet, it feels as if there won't be a tomorrow. Hmm. Textbooks scattered up and placed here. Nothing new. Extra papers here. Pens in the pens holder. It's weird that I can't save. I find that very odd. The bulletin board. This has nothing to do with you. See, this even has like similar classroom from the first game. Except, well, monochrome. There's signs that it has been moved before. Hmm. Windows. A sile outside? There's none alive. Nah? Who are you? She's busy with her assignments. Best not to disturb her. What happens if I do? Can I copy your homework? No. Oh, what's up? These assignments won't finish themselves. Can I bother you again? Are you feeling alright? Then don't exhaust yourself. Well, she didn't bully me. The monitor's desk. 
His notebook has been placed there. It contains the key to the cabinet. Can I not have it? I guess I can't. Someone is staring at their cell phone with a big smile on their face. They're serving the school forum, oh no. They haven't seemed to notice you. You decide to leave her alone. They suddenly burst out into laughter. The cell phone drops from their hand and onto the floor. You pick it up instinctively. The senior high school, oh. You're shocked by the photo on the phone. The cell phone is slapped from your hand. You suddenly feel a hot pain on your face. Yo, I'm gonna slap the fuck out of you. Who allowed you to touch my phone? Oh no, my phone has been defiled. Now I have to consider buying a new one. What, Photoshop? I have no idea what you're talking about. Tch. I heard that. Has a late night part-time job. Really? There's a few work opportunities for high school students. Indeed. It's said that she lives in a poor family, so she has to take a work-study program. You mean she earned a tuition fee for this elite school? It must be a big deal then. Her job, I mean. What is it? What is it? Oh please, it's too embarrassing to guess. There's nothing shameful about making a guess. If you say so. I think it's called compensated dating. What? But she looks so pure. She's the angel for the men leaving the soap land, what? That might be. It seems sort of horrible to me. Ah, oh, this is a cool game. I like this mechanic. A desk with a paper plane on it. Die is written on it. A clean desk. Let me defile you. Someone, yeah. I hate you too. What's this? It's a trash can. There's a lot of trash and spitballs in it. Just like this world. Nothing else in there? What about this desk? Let's talk to her again. Are you okay? Your face is pale. Shall we head home early? Oh, is this a friend of mine? No, that's fine. A desk with some scratch papers on top of it. Was this here earlier? There's nothing inside. Are you sure? Okay. Tidy desk? There's a lot of scratch papers inside it. Anything else? No? This game doesn't seem that complicated. Yeah. You remember that? That masterpiece? <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> Someone's chatting happily. And they didn't even notice you. Hello? Okay, they don't notice me. Let me s Oh. Ah, uh, the prima donna is here. Are you wandering around to inform us of your arrival? We all know that you have such great grades. But could you please tell us how you managed that while still being such a bitch? I'm curious about that too. Maybe our grades suck because we can't keep our minds on class while there's someone like her in the classroom. Ah, oh, I get that feeling. Do grades really make that much of a difference? That girl is always so confident. All day. Every day. But what if it's all a facade? How could someone be so superficial and yet be such a schemer at the same time? Oh, that's the point. My bad. <laughs> exactly! Wee hee! He. She's so disgusting. That's right. She sees herself as being extraordinary somehow. Being favored by these teachers, who will never see her as a bitch she is. I find her disagreeable myself. How come the best boy in class fell for such a... 
I cried about him for days. Someday, that bitch is going to get what she deserves. Hmm? She deserves her retribution, doesn't she? I guess so. You guys are jerks. Maybe this is why there's no tomorrow. Someone is watching boys playing basketball out on the playground. They seem really engrossed with it. They're pretending that you're invisible. How about we head home together? Keep away from her. What's wrong? Keep yourself away from this jinx. Pardon? Don't you know? He fancied her and became a sacrifice. Was it her fault? Who knows? She's been so indifferent about it. Maybe she wishes all of us were dead as well. Sounds a bit overstated. If you stay together with her, we won't play with you anymore. That's... Well, I don't really blame her for keeping away from me. Yeah, I can't really blame her. This is a situation that's not in her control. Someone is gulping down cakes. Crumbles are falling everywhere. Uh, hi there. Would you like some cake? Just kidding. I'm not giving you any. You can't even afford it. I mean, you don't deserve it. Have you heard? About what? He died because of buying a cake for his crush. What? It can't be. Didn't you check the photo? The cake box is pretty recognizable. It is. I even heard that I love you was written on the cake. It makes me so angry. If they weren't killed by that slut, we could have become lovey-dovey. She doesn't even feel compassion for him, nor his affection. Why couldn't it have been her who died? Exactly. He was such a gentleman. He died because of this. This disgusting whore. I hope she's cursed to never be loved again. Yo, can I do my homework now? Oh, wait. Oh, no, that's just a heart. I thought there was a heart on here. Also, what is in that cabinet? Can I not get the cabinet? I guess this is just a, um... Like an Easter egg for the first game. There's a vulgar novel inside of a desk. You take a look at the title page. Do you know that devils live among us? Devote to them your soul and the devil grants you wishes. In order to save his younger sister from death, the older brother summoned a devil. You're starting to feel bored. You put the book back. Wait. Isn't this related to the devil in the first game? I've talked to you. I don't think I've checked this. What? What is it? Have I checked it before? Oh, this is the boy's desk from the first game. I see. That's why she has the dot dot dot. It's because he died in the car crash. Okay. A pile of unfinished... Did I talk to you? Someone is copying another classmate's assignments casually. What are you doing here? Disgusting me to death? Nice try. It seems you were blissfully of what you were doing then. Or are you simply so shameless? I say you should just behave yourself. Splash! Look at her, literally head over heels. Not in love, but in water. Be careful not to get yourself wet as well, girls. You deserve it. <laughs> nice eyes. So I guess you'll never say uncle. I got the school bag. You really don't know how to share your wealth with your dearest classmates, do you? No patches? Is it for real? I mean, um, real... 
Wow, you finished all the homework already? I bet the teacher will go mad when they find out you didn't even touch it all this time. Oh, you want it back. Nice try. <laughs> you deserve this. Enough. There's no reason to keep enduring this. To this world in black. Without anything to deter you. Can I go home? She's busy with her assignment. Best not to disturb her. Is something wrong? Well, tell me if anything comes up. It seems like one person is actually nice to me. Yo, friend, I need help. Tell me, what's the problem? Something the matter? Forget them. I'm right here. I will be here by your side, no matter what happens. You look tired. Let's go home, alright? I will be with you. Oh, don't worry about me. You should have thought more of yourself. So, let's pack up and leave. Neko recently pushed out a new strawberry and sticky black rice dumpling. I've been planning to try it out with you. A long journey through grief and gloominess. With some company, you reach this final conclusion. Happiness shall be reclaimed. Smiling again is like experiencing the satisfaction of watching the domino you. White with black. Oh, this is different. What was that? Nothing? Well, tell me if anything comes up. No news is good news. I'm going back to my assignments then. Then did she do it like you said? She herself knows best. You think it's your business then? You think you're the righteous then? Are you serious? Forget it. She's pretending to be busy with her assignments. Leave them alone. I say you should just behave yourself. You know, it's great that you have a good friend and I didn't expect her to actually interject this time. Hey, what did you slap her for? Oh, I'm so sorry about that. They say making an apology super sis. <laughs> Were you hurt? It's okay then. What are you talking about? Nothing special. She's rolling her eyes at you. She lowers her head and resumes eating her cakes. Oh, you took the key from the monitor's desk. That's interesting. What's in here anyway? You've unlocked the cabinet. My friend, what are you doing? I'll be back from lavatory soon. Oh, she's taking a piss. You rummaged through the drawer. You found a knife. What happens if I just leave? You're not going to leave like this. Oh my. You flip through some of the pages subconsciously. A sketch slips out. Oh, It's a crying angel. Looks like Alice with broken wings. Oh, okay. You put the drawing back. You moved a flower pot and found a key to the front door. I used the key. I used the tape. 
There's only a place to go there. This. You've locked a door. Oh. We should use the tape. There's only a place to go there. What do I use a tape for? You. What's that for? Are you going to cut the cake for me? <laughs> or did you think you can frighten me? Murder! And don't you dare get any closer, you murderer. Why are all the doors locked? Help! Help! Oh. Hold up! Uh, we'll go for the corner. Oh. Oh, you can hear the squishing! Demonetized. I'm sorry for the. There's one more. I'm sorry, but I was just. Died. All died. A dark black world covered in red. So warm, so pleasing, so happy. I can see the angel smiling naively. Yet in such an inferno, in this blood ritual, wasn't I the real devil? And red over black. What? That's rare. You wanna make big news? You've been famous enough in the forum, though. Come on, smile so that I can take a photo. A disgusting corpse. You've already taken the cell phone she had. You're not interested in the monitor's desk. A desk with a cup in it. The desk is a mess. A desk with a word carved onto it. What word? There's many books inside it. You found a spitball inside a desk. Crumpled paper. You flatten out the paper. Written on the paper is... How you bought the hamster? Yeah, but it's kinda cute. Too cute to kill. That's okay, leave the rest to me. You need it into a ball again. You guys killed it? That's horrible. There's a lot of scratch papers inside it. Anything in there, though? Also, where is the teacher? Scratch papers. Nothing inside. Clean desk. Comic book inside. It seems to be a story about magical girls. Maho Shoujo? There's a strange, smoky scent. Something's inside this desk. You picked up scraps of paper. Did they burn it? Too damaged to read. More pieces to become legible. Maybe there's some more pieces laying around. Trash. You throw the spitball into the trash can. Scraps of paper fluttered out. You pick them up. You try to arrange... Maybe there's some more, more pieces? A revolting corpse. You found scraps of paper in the jacket pocket. Oh, okay. I didn't, didn't know it'd be that one. You try to stick them. It's almost completed now. Repaired paper. Not all the pieces are accounted for, but you can barely make out what's written. Written on the paper is... So, we stick to your plan. I mean, all of you. You've got nothing to worry about. We don't like her anyway. Then make it quick and clean. There are figures on the corner of the reverse side. It seems to be 8243. 
A243, okay. A243. It requires a lock screen password. A243. 8243. Correct! It's the OS desktop. You search around a bit. Photoshop these and publish them to forums, and we'll have ourselves a deal. No problem, check us out. You know this portrait. You had a key? Is... is that... You made this. It's okay. Whatever it is, I will be here by your side. No scum. They deserve it. Whatever you've done, I will handle them. So, don't worry about anything. Everything will be fine. I swear it. And transparent black. Congratulations! You've collected three endings. Extra room unlocked. Do I just leave for the extra room? Ah, oh, I do. No horseplay in the corridors. Oh, cool, you have reflections? Yeah, well, that's hard to do. Can I just leave? Uh, maybe this is the extra room. Character profiles. 15 years old. Part-time job in school, yep. Oh, she had no special feelings for, um, whatever his name was. But after he died, she was blamed and mentally broke down. Her friend. 15 years old and somewhat special. Plays the role of dummy in a class. Now, I thought she was a demon or something. This is the guy that died. He's actually quite popular. He fell for her, but felt that he wasn't good enough. He died before he could confess his feelings, which is the first game. Alright, well that's it for Transparent Black. Cool game, I really like this. Anyway, thanks for watching the video, hope you liked it, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.